Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Can I use an expired ID to vote absentee? When it comes to voting, identification is a crucial part of the process, especially in Texas. Here's what you need to know about using an expired ID for absentee voting. Acceptable forms of ID. In Texas, there are several forms of photo ID that are accepted for voting. These include a Texas driver license, Texas election identification certificate, Texas personal identification card, Texas handgun license, United States military identification card, United States citizenship certificate, and a United States passport, book or card, 4%. Expiration dates for IDs. For voters aged 18 to 69, the acceptable form of photo identification can be expired, but not for more than four years. However, for voters age 70 or older, the ID can be expired for any length of time as long as it is otherwise valid. Absentee voting specifics. When it comes to absentee voting, the rules are somewhat different. You generally need to include a copy of a valid photo ID with your absentee ballot application. However, the specifics about expired IDs for absentee voting are not explicitly detailed in the same way as in-person voting. General guidelines. For in-person voting, expired IDs within the four-year limit for those under 70 and any expiration for those 70 or older are accepted. Since absentee voting typically requires a current or recently expired ID, it's reasonable to infer that similar rules might apply, but it's best to check with the local election officials for the most accurate and up-to-date information. Reasonable impediment declaration. If you don't have an acceptable form of photo ID, you can fill out a Reasonable Impediment Declaration, RID, at the polls, or provide alternative forms of ID, such as a utility bill, bank statement, or government check. However, this process is more commonly associated with in-person voting rather than absentee voting. Final steps. To ensure you can vote absentee with an expired ID, contact your local election office or the Secretary of State's office for specific guidance. They can provide the most current and detailed information regarding your particular situation. By understanding these guidelines, you can make sure your vote counts, even if your ID is expired within the accepted timeframes. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.